Hi Crafty Angels, Vanessa here. Welcome back to my channel guys. It's Vanessa from Angel Rose. And I'm here today with a package from Miss Neri, aka uh, DC Scrap and Rooster, aka Narita's Creations. And this is the box that she sent me with the purchase that I made from her. I have it upside down so I don't show addresses. So I will show you everything that is in the box. Okay, this is the first thing that came in the box. I got three rolls of this. And it's really cute. Let me see if I can snip that little thing here. It's a piece of tape, but I can't seem to. Let me see. Let's do it this way. There we go. Okay. Okay, is this nifty little uh, yellow rose ribbon? And there's three rolls of that. Sorry about that. Here's the other two rolls. And then I'm gonna get a something to put this on. We got this. Oh, this brings it out really well. Okay. We have it in that color, which is like a, hmm, a really light accru or tan color. Then we have this. Let me see if I can zoom in so y'all can see it better. There we go. Perfect. Okay, so we have that. And we have this one. These are really pretty. This is like a wedding white. A really wedding white. Let me see if I can find a solid, more solid color. So it'll bring it out better. Hmm. Okay. Then we have this gorgeous piece here. Which I can take and if I snip it here, right in here, um I can make it see, this would be one applique. This is about four appliques right here. There's two, and there's two, okay? The same thing with this. If I snip it right, I can make three different appliques out of this. Um, let me see. The same with the first one I showed. One, two, three. Probably four appliques out of this one. Okay. We got these cute little ones here. I have, there's more somewhere in the box. <laughs> and here's another one. With four appliques. And it's the same thing as I showed before. Then we have this. Oh, this brings it up perfect. See? You can cut it into sections, and this is about maybe a yard and a half. And this is all from Neri. She always packages her so stuff really, really nice. Oh, look, and I even have it in green, like a mint green. Let me take it out of the bag here. And you can find her on YouTube as DC Scrap and Rooster, or on I think it's Etsy at uh. Narita's uh, 
Creations, I think it is. I'll link everything down below. Here's a mint green. It, it's not showing that, that way on camera, but it is like a mint green color. Then we have this little applique, which is cute. Here's another one like it. Here's another flower. And here's a different one, which I can use the leaves on one part. And we got maybe two different, two or three different appliques there. And then we have this lace here. Okay, we have this one. Which, if I do it right, I can make these into some small appliques also. Okay. Here's another one. I can use the leaves on a certain pr in a, on a project, and then use this tulip. Yeah, this tulip on another project. And we have this eyelet lace. Okay. this pretty lace which if you cut it you can make two different laces out of it you can make a border lace out of this one which is kind of cute there's another one that I can cut into different appliques And I will be doing a recap on all of this as I usually do. That's that. Then we have this here again. Cut it down right here. And you got more appliques. I mean, you never know what you can use this stuff for. Then we have this one. This is the right side here. For that one. We have this gorgeous one. Now this one here. One, two, three. You know, three different laces here. And then we have this one. Again, you can put ribbon through here, or you can cut it and make three different laces out of it. And we have this gorgeous one. Again. You can make, here's one applique. There's a whole bunch of appliques on this one, guys. A whole bunch. You never know what I'll do with this stuff. This one's gorgeous. See the flowers here? If you cut in between here, you got some appliques there. You know? This is how my brain thinks with all my laces and trims and all that. See here, you got one right here. You can also cut it, make it into so many different. See, it's one, two, three, four, five, six. Six different little trims there. Here's a lace with roses in it, which is pretty. Here's another uh, lace that you can put ribbon or another kind of lace through. You know, it's, I mean, literally, these are endless. There. Now, she does have some boxes that are available, 
and I have a post on my personal page for her um, her boxes she's selling them all and they're pretty much a lot see oh this is the right side I'm sorry now this you can make into some tiny little appliques two here and then a tiny little trim at the bottom you can contact her on Facebook right now so to get your order in here's another one okay that's the same thing as this one but in an ichru color it's almost like a yellow but on you see it shows yellow more yellow on the camera but it's not see so this is in two different colors and then we have this eyelet trim <laughs> Here, it's pretty. It's like an egg crew color. Here's a yellow lace, which I think I have it in white, also, if I'm not mistaken. Somewhere, never know. Here's another lace, which you can make two tiny trims out of. Here's another applique, which is gorgeous. Now, if I look at it the way I look, okay, one, two, two different appliques here, and here's just another one that I showed you like before. It looks like a tulip to me. You can cut the leaves off the top and use it in a different project. Okay, here's another one of the little sequin flowers. Here's a bow. And here's this lace. I've never seen this one. But it looks kind of cute. I have to figure out what... I'm. A, it's like a base tannish color. I have to figure out what I'm going to do with that. And here's this one. See? One, two different appliques here. Maybe three up here. I'm telling you, it's it's endless with these applicate these laces and trim. See, you can cut these and make seashell appliques out of them. I've never seen this one either. Here's another one. This way. This way. Okay, we got it. <laughs> you can cut these and make some appliques out of it. Oops. You guys, you just never know what you can find. See? Here? One, two, three different laces. Did the same thing. But if you cut them here, where you can add a tiny ribbon, you get three different laces there. We have this one. Again, two different laces here. This here, from my view, I don't know from your view if it looks the same, but right here, it looks like a bow. Okay, next is this one. Oh, I like this one. Never seen it, but I like it. Everything is like maybe one to two yards. It depends on what it is. Here's this one. Oh, this one's pretty. Guys, these laces and trims, you never know. See? It's, they're pretty laces and trims. Here's this one. See? One, two. You got the two leaves. You can make a flower with it. Then we have this eyelet trim. That one has fl little flowers on the bottom. We have this lace, which is gorgeous. Then we have this lace here, 
which is beautiful. It looks like a tree. See right there how it looks like a tree? Mmm. Guys, the ideas that's going through my head. Here's this eyelid trim. Yeah, I don't know the ideas that's going through my head through my head right now. <laughs> Wait, look, just looking at these. This one, if you cut here and here, you got an applique. Okay, if you trim it there and those two spots, you got a nice little applique. Here. Hmm. One, two, three trims. Hey. And this one looks like it's a floral kind of lace. Oh, dear. This is purple. It's like a light, light lavender purple. And it's kind of stretchy. Hmm. That trim is gonna be used on something. Oh. And I got these two. They're the same. They're eyelid trim and they're a lavender color. And then we have this one. This can be done into two different trims. This one's a flat floral trim, a lace. Then we have this one. Oh, this one I have in white too. Somewhere in the stack. Right here. There we go. The same pattern. Oh, yeah, same pattern. Okay. Right there. Then we have this one. Oh, we have this one. Alright, we showed this one already. But, it's okay. We just never know. This one. Oh, this one's pretty in pink. This is a floral. Oh, look how... This is kind of sheer. Almost like a silky feel. Okay. Let's see. We have this one. I got three boxes from her, so I'm trying not to show the same thing twice, but if it pops up, it pops up. Now, this here is some um, grommet trim. And if you want to, I will show y'all how I use this in a video. Okay? I will do a video showing y'all how I use grommet. And trust me guys, there's tons of this stuff that I haven't showed yet. Okay. Next, we have this one. Oh, can show that one again? No, it doesn't matter. I gotta show the whole box anyway. We have this one. We have this one here. This one's pretty neat. You you have three trims in one. Okay. Then you have this eyelid trim. Then you have this one, which looks like, I don't know what kind of flower, but it looks like a flower in there. And you can use it for a trim, you can use it for anything. Then we have this one. Which is pretty neat. Let 
this one here, which is black and pink, which is pretty neat. Pretty nifty. We'll put figures up and then use the card. And we have this one, looks like little flowers and uh, mandalas in it. Then we have this one. This trim. Well, there's some pretty neat trims in here. We have this one. Scallop. I think that, yeah, I did show this one already, but that's alright. That's alright. You never know what you get in them. have this trim. I know most of them I showed already, but we'll show them again. And then we have this one. This is a cute one. This one has flowers and leaves in it, but if you cut them right, you can cut them to where they can be used as appliques. This is all packaged very nice and neat in the box. Here we have another one. You can use this two trims or you can use it together and put ribbon through the middle. Then we have this one. Oh, we had this one in black. Now we have it in white. This is really neat. You can make different trims out of that one. You know, here's this one. Some pretty nifty looking uh, laces and trims. Most of them look sort of vintagey. Here's this one, which has flowers and things in it. And we have this one. This one, this one's all these. Guys, the ideas, the ideas, the ideas. Here, here, one, one, two trims. Hey. Like I said, when you order laces and trims, you never know what you're gonna do with them until you actually use them. Here's this one. Now, here's this one again. And it's, I don't know, it's like an ecru color. It's like a light, light tan color. Hmm. Then we have this one again. This one looks like a fence with flowers on the top. I'm telling you. <laughs> the ideas I have in my head for some of these, you never know what's going to come out. Got this one. Okay. Pick this one up. Guys, if you see, I'm only using this little area here. This one again. Then we have this one again. This one. The idea is just coming for the fall in my head. This one. Ideas aren't being released just yet. And we got this orange one. Again. It's like a coral. It's a coral color. And we 
have this one. Yes, I don't think I can do a recap. I'm already doing a recap. <laughs> By showing them over again here. Oh, I like this one. See? Right down the middle. And you got that. You can use this like a sort of like a window and door trim on the project. And we have this one again. And we have this one again. Well, we have this one, this applique, which is like a mint green. I think that's it that I haven't shown already. That's pretty much it. Everything's all doubles and triples. And we got these three. You know? So, I want to say thank you all for watching. Please like, share, comment. Give me a thumbs up if you like this video. And also, go and... Ooh, I haven't shown this one. And, uh have a chit chat with Neri. She's Neri Arkees on Facebook. DC Scrapper Rooster on YouTube. And Narita. Narita's Creations on Etsy, but I don't think she has any more on Etsy, so I will make sure I link everything down below in the comment section. And y'all will see all the photos at the end of this video. So if I miss anything, it will be all in the photos. So thank you all for watching. Please like, share, comment. Uh, give me a thumbs up, like I said, if y'all like this video. And also visit Neri. Message Neri to make your purchase. I don't know how many boxes she has left. But do make y'all purchase and go from there. Um, sorry for the big arm. Stay crafty. Stay friendly. Stay kind. Be blessed. And also, um, thank you for all for watching. I will see you all in the next video. And on the flip side, crafty hugs, everyone. Bye-bye for now.